The Honda Civic is a line of compact cars manufactured by Honda. It was originally a subcompact vehicle. The Civic has gone through several generational changes, becoming both larger and more upmarket. It currently falls between the Honda Fit and the Honda Accord. For 2016, the 10th generation Honda Civic has arrived and was designed from a clean sheet of paper. It is completely renovated inside out and comes equipped with many safety features and technologies which make it one of the best Honda Civic ever made to this date. News for 2016, the new Honda Civic comes in many different trims level, with the LX being the base model. Next up is the EX, EXT, and EXL, the top of the line version which is the Honda Civic Touring, which includes all the EXL feature, plus Honda Sensing Safety Suite, as well as a power front seat, heated outboard rear seats, navigation, LED headlights, and a 450 watt premium audio system. The one I have here today is the 2016 Honda Civic EX, dressed beautifully in modern steel metallic. Some of the standard features included in the EX version are 16 inch alloy wheels, power sunroof, remote engine start, keyless entry, push button ignition, LED tail light, as well as LED daytime running light, heated mirrors, a lane watch camera located on the right side view mirror that shows the right side view down the car when the right turn signal is activated, a 7 inch touchscreen interface, a second USB port in the center console, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto capability, a 180 watt audio system, as well as many other features. Up front, the new Honda Civic EX comes standard with a pair of projector beam halogen headlight with auto on and off. Integrated into the headlight is the LED daytime running light, as well as the turn signal light. The touring model will also come with a full LED headlight, including high and low beams. The new Honda Civic comes with a very aggressive lower bumper design, with the two black scoops that direct vital air into the engine. And in the middle is the uh, grill with a large chrome piece that runs through each front headlight. Here is a closer look at the grill. Variable intermittent windshield wipers are also a standard on the EX. The touring version will also get the intermittent rain sensing windshield wipers. Moving to the side, you see the cornering light. The EX model also comes standard with 16 inch alloy wheels with 215 55 all season tires. Behind the wheel is the set of 11.1 inch power assisted internally ventilated brake disc and the brake caliber painted in silver. Body color side view mirror. On top is the sunroof that can be tilted up or slide open for an open air feeling. Behind the rear wheel is the 10.2 inch solid rear brake disc. It also comes with vehicle stability assist, anti-lock braking system, electronic brake force distribution, as well as brake assist. Tire monitoring system are also equipped on all four wheels. To the back, you see the unique and stylish C-shaped LED tail light with integrated LED brake light as well as turn signal light. Very unique tail light. At the bottom is the black rear diffuser with a single exhaust tip located under the bumper on the right hand side. Rear deflector are also integrated to the rear bumper. And a look at the rear spoiler. Rear view camera is located above the license plate and will activate once the vehicle is in reverse. LED brake light on top. Ok, here I have the remote with Honda logo on the back. On the remote I have the lock, unlock, engine start, trunk release as well as panic button. Now to start the engine, you first have to press the lock button. Then press and hold the engine start button for a couple seconds until you see the turn signal light blinking and engine will start. To turn it off, just press the engine button once again to turn it off. Now let's open it up and check out the interior. 
The car does come equipped with mode access key system. So with the key in your pocket, just press the button located on the door handle once to lock. After a few seconds, place your hand behind the door handle to unlock. The exterior color is known as Modern Steel Metallic, featuring two-tone interior with black on the dash, black and gray on the door panel, and gray seat with black and white stripe running down the middle, as well as silver aluminum trims throughout. Very nice looking interior. Now let's jump into the driver's seat, start it up and see how it sounds. So with your foot on the brake, push the start button to start. Very nice. Now let's pop the hood and see what the 2016 Honda Civic EX have to offer. Under the hood, the Honda Civic EX comes equipped with a 2-liter inline 4-cylinder engine 16 valve DOHC IV tech valve train with continuous variable transmission, multi point fuel injection with eco assist system. It is pushing out 158 horsepower and 138 pound feet of torque. Can hit from 0 to 60 in about 8 seconds. EPA estimated fuel economy is 31 CD, 41 highway, and 35 combined. Very impressive mile per gallon rating. Okay, now let's shut it down and take a detailed look at the interior. And here's a look at the driver's side door panel. It is all black with gray in the middle, as well as aluminum accenting trim. Both front windows are fully automatic, and there you have the lock and unlock, as well as the side view mirror control. Down there you have the trunk release button and the storage compartment. There you have the speaker and a tweeter on top. There's the pedal. And here is a closer look at the seat. Seats are made with fabric and cloth material with black and white strip running down the middle. It is nothing special, but not uh, with cheap material either. And it does come with the manual seat adjustment. The three-spoke design steering wheel is fully wrapped in black leather with perforated top and bottom section with aluminum accenting trims in the middle. It also features a multi-function control side-by-side -side for your convenience with control for audio, voice command, cruise control, as well as the most frequent use function in the vehicle. There you have your light control as well as the turn signal light. To the right you have the windshield wiper control. And here is a closer look at the instrument cluster. It is all digital with the uh, information screen in the middle. And steering wheel does feature a manual tilt and telescopic steering column. Looking at the left, you have the driver's side air vent with beautiful aluminum trims around it. Down here, you have the traction on and off. And down there, you have the hood release lever. And here's a closer look at the dash. Now this particular model comes with an audio system that includes 8 speakers located throughout the cabin 
and pushing out a total of 180 watts of audio for both you and your passengers. Okay, and the dash is uh, totally redesigned for the 2016 model. On top you see dual event as well as the emergency hazard light. And here's the uh, 7 inch touchscreen multimeter display. On the left hand side you have your different menu button. And there you have your audio and your different sources. Now the system does have the browser, internet browser, so you can browse uh, through the internet. And again, all the uh, different sources like uh, info, Honda link, phone, setting, smartphone connection, and app list. And inside the app list, you have your apps, calculator, browser, gallery, and downloads, which is the thing that you downloaded. Can't believe the Honda Civic comes with all these uh, new gadgets. Very nice system. And you know you can connect your iPhone or Android phone and it'll pull all your apps to the screen which is very cool. Okay and under the screen you have your full zone climate control. Down there you have the storage compartment. And here's a look at the gear shift lever. It is wrapped in leather and feels very nice in your hand. So to put into reverse just press the unlock and pull down for reverse. And the uh, rear backup camera will activate on the screen with guidance line and it will also move as you turn the wheel move down again for neutral and down again for drive and down again for sport mode and if you pull it down one more time you get into the uh, L mode very simple and easy to use there you have the brake hold button and the parking brake over to the left, uh, to the right, you have the uh, eco on and off button. And here you have a large uh, center storage compartment here with dual cup holders. Okay, you can also slide the uh, cup holders up and down, and then you have another cup holder at the bottom and another USB plug. very nice convenient feature there is definitely a lot of uh, storage feature on that uh, center storage compartment and here you have the beautiful aluminum trims on the dash and the starch uh, glove box storage compartment and once again a closer look at the seat the seat actually looks uh, really good and on top you have the light button and you can also press it down to turn on and off the light and there you have the one touch open close and tilt sunroof and of course you have to manually close the uh, sunshade there you have the rear view mirror sun visor mirror with a card holder okay now looking at the rear seat look like rear seats offer sitting for three and I can tell you right now that this Civic offer more room than my uh, Mercedes CLA have I can tell you just by looking at it and then the seat does feature 60 uh, or 40 folded uh, option and here's the look at the rear driver side door panel rear windows are not uh, automatic and there you have the storage compartment okay now let's get into the uh, rear seat and see how it is in the back but first let me show you the look to the front cabin I like that new cabin design and on top you see the sunroof There is no event for the uh, Honda Civic EX trim. And this is how much legroom I have left with the seat all the way down. On top you have the door handle, the light, and it also comes with a mosquito. 
very cool look to the back and rear seat pocket are only on the passenger side on the uh, both side you have the hook all right now let's pop the trunk and see how much cargo space the trunk offer and as you can see the uh, gas cap is located on the driver's side just push it in to open and it does not require premium fuel just unleaded fuel will do and it is capless so the trunk in the Civic EX offer 15.1 cubic feet of cargo space which is very decent for a class now keep in mind that you can fold down the rear seat into 60 or 40 split for your convenience and all you have to do is pull the lever located on top there's one on each side simple enough and here looks like you have your floor mat and let's see what we have down there we have a uh, spare tires and your tools now overall the new 2016 Honda Civic is a compact vehicle offering seating for five passengers it did improve a lot over the previous model and come nicely equipped with many safety features and technologies three passengers can fit comfortably in the back and the front cabins are also very spacious as well though the EX trim model doesn't offer much uh, luxurious feature but keep in mind that you can go for the touring that will come loaded with more option and feature but the price will also rise as you go up alright guys that is it for today's review I hope you guys enjoyed the 2016 Honda Civic go ahead and leave me a comment letting me know how you guys like it and don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more future video 